Today I am going to show you how to simulate cloth in Marvelous Designer, using a Lembic file from Maya. I have animated female character here. Okay, so first, select your animated character mesh. Go to upper left corner for modeling tab and change it to animation. Then click on key and go to bake simulation setting box. A new tab will pop up on your viewport. Check your settings of starting and ending frame in time range setting and hit bake option. I have already done it so I am not going to do again. After the baking is completed, then you can see the red key markers on your time slider. Now I am going to export it into a Lembic file. To do that, select your animated mesh. Go to cache option then Alembic cache. Click on export selection to Alembic setting option. Check your animation time range and hit export selection option. It's going to take time, so I am fast forwarding the video. After exporting is done, open your Marvelous Designer software. To import your Alembic animation file, go to File, Import and click on Alembic option. Select your file and open it. Check your scale and FPS setting, and click OK. To check your animation, go to upper right corner simulation tab and change it to animation. Here you can check your animation. Now go back to simulation tab and design your outfit. I already have my outfit so, I'm going to import it. To do that, go to file, add, and click on garment. Select your file and open it. Now go to Animation tab again, and change your simulation quality to Animation Stable. After that, just click on the recorder icon to start simulating your garment. After simulation is completed, go to File, Export, and click on Alembic Ogawa option. Give name to your file and click Save. Check your FPS and other settings and click OK. It going to take time, so keep patience. Now back to Maya software and go to cache, Alembic cache, and click import Alembic. Select your garment Alembic file and click import. Look like we have size issue, but it's not a big problem. I'm going to scale it down. Here we go. Perfecto. Now we can check the animation. Hit play button, and here we have cloth simulation. 
My animation is not good, so it looking weird but, now you know how to do cloth simulation using, Maya Lembic character mesh. I hope you find this video helpful. If you like this video please like, subscribe, and press the bell icon, so you don't miss any informative video, as well as it also helped me to complete my first 1000 subscriber. Thank you for watching this video. Have a nice day.